In this video, we're going to take a look at what it looks like from the student perspective to access, work on, and submit a Canva assignment that you have created for them. So we access Canva as teachers and students through ClassLink. So I am logged in as the student in ClassLink, and I'm going to go ahead and click on the Canva app which is going to load my page. So I'm in Canva, but the assignment that I created for the student is not going to show up here in recent designs. The way that student's going to access this for the first time is through their notifications. So you can see here, I have two notifications waiting for me. And if I click on that notification, I can see here, this is the assignment that my teacher has just assigned. So I see it in my notifications, so I'm going to go ahead and click on it. So once I have clicked on it, now this will actually um, open up in my recent designs the next time I go back into Canva as a student and I don't have to go to notifications, but initially you do. So here is the template. I am again in as the student, so I can go in here and start making any changes to this and completing the assignment that my teacher gave. I'm not gonna sit here and go through that process, but I'll change a few things here before I actually submit it to my teacher. So I can change some color schemes, et cetera. Okay. All right, so let's say that this assignment is complete and you're ready to submit this back to your teacher. What the student is going to do is they're going to click on the upper right-hand side, the share button. After you click on the share button, you are going to click on send to teacher. And then you are going to start typing in the last name of your teacher and it will begin to populate with teacher names as you type it in. So let's say for example, I click inside here and I just start typing in my teacher's name. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on my teacher's name. I can put a message in here if I want to, any um, information that my teacher might need for this assignment. And then I'm going to go ahead and click send. And that's it. So it's been sent to my teacher. My teacher will have the opportunity to review it and provide feedback or and or mark it as complete. You will know when your teacher has left feedback or has marked it complete because the next time you log into Canva, it, you will get a notification here as well indicating that there is feedback or that it has been marked complete. So this is an area where you have to keep an eye on for any assignments that you're getting as well as any assignments that are coming back to you.